everybody and welcome to Word of Mouth Theatre, video reviews to help spread the word of mouth about the beauty and magic that can be found within live theatre. These reviews have been made to help create new and build on existing audiences for theatre and to help spread word of mouth about some of the fabulous shows and venues that are putting on some amazing experiences of entertainment for people, not just nationally but globally. You can find more of these reviews if you search on Facebook for Word of Mouth Theatre and if you go to the About section, you can find a link to a YouTube channel that's got lots of reviews from fabulous shows and venues throughout the north of the UK and London. And you can also find these reviews if you go into the iTunes store and search for Word of Mouth Theatre. In this episode, we're going to be talking about Moscow City Ballet's 25th Silver Anniversary Tour. And this was running at St George's Concert Hall in Bradford on Sunday the 12th and Monday the 13th of January 2014. Moscow City Valley's 25th Silver Anniversary Tour is currently showcasing four productions that are running throughout the UK and these productions include Swan Lake, The Nutcracker, Romeo and Juliet and Don Quixote at St George's Hall in Bradford. On Sunday the 12th was a showcase of Romeo and Juliet and then when I attended this performance on the Monday, Monday's performance was Don Quixote. Now, Don Quixote is not necessarily known for story as much as something like Romeo and Juliet or The Nutcracker, but it's something that's equally as fabulous in terms of the themes that are covered within the story, the characters, and the experience of theatricality. Now, a little bit of an insight into the story of Don Quixote. If not everybody who's watching this knows, Don Quixote is basically, in a nutshell, going on the theme of the Nutcracker, a story about an individual who gets inspired by reading stories about myths and legends and people that are going on journeys and going on adventures. And through getting inspired, this individual goes on a journey himself and finds lots of conflict, lots of adventure and lots of experience throughout life in this real life and also this fantasy journey that he goes on with his experience of finding this time and this experience within life. We see lots of emotion and lots of experience that are replicated in the dance with the individual performers and their characterizations of the people where they are depicting on the stage. And we see some great storytelling by dance and there's some great traditional ballet techniques that are performed within this production. And there's also some great resemblances of emotions such as desire, such as fear, such as enjoyment, such as sadness and people who are experiencing these emotions both as individuals and people who are part of groups as well, replicating groups of people and threat friends, if you like, that we meet, come into contact with, and then also move on from throughout life. So some great replication of timeless experiences that everybody can relate to. And there's some fabulous costumes in this production. There's some great period costumes with some great ballet gowns and some great if you like free-flowing dresses for the ladies that are really colourful and for the guys we've got some great costumes in terms of the period costumes and also the theme of this production that's set in Spain we've got some really nice smart costumes if you like some great shirts some really nice overcoats and also some great matador costumes with the bullfighter and also some great tights as well some great trousers and some great footwear with the period footwear, things like shoes with really interesting buckles on them, some great, if you like, nice shoes for the ladies and also the gents, and we've also some, got some traditional nice ballet shoes in there as well. And there's some fabulous stagings in this production, some really beautiful backdrops of paintings that are, if you like, replicating what I would say, something like what you would experience in a grand renaissance painting from one of the Italian masters and these paintings and backdrops really help to replicate scenes from the Spanish streets which include some of the Spanish houses and also nice scenes that you might see in a city square if you like, one of the squares that might be in something like Barcelona 
and there's some great textures in here, some great colours, and with the lighting this creates great effects that symbolises things like a free-flowing water from a fountain, and also great transitions between the night and day, which really helps to make this atmospheric and energetic to witness all this colour and all this light and all this art coming together on the stage and with a fabulous orchestration from, I would say, around a 25-piece orchestra that provides great entertainment and is really nice to hear in the fabulous acoustics of St George's Hall in Bradford. So, great performances, great combination of the elements that make a great theatre and a great performance if you are somebody who is a ballet fan and also if you haven't experienced ballet. This is something that you should go and check out and find out what it's all about because it's a great experience to be had. So, we'll just look at a couple of images from the programme now. This is a programme of Moscow City Ballet, the 25th Silver Anniversary Tour. And this program has information on all the shows I've mentioned that are part of this tour, which includes Swan Lake, The Nutcracker, Romeo and Juliet and Don Quixote. And as with all theatre programmes, there's some great information about the people behind the production, the company and some great photographs on the production that you'll have seen as well. So it's a great little memento. And here we're going to look at some of the images here. We can see some of the great examples of the colourful costumes and great choreography with the great paintings behind here. And again here we've got really examples of great colourful choreography and great paintings here on the backdrops. And if we move on we can see here, this is just a nice picture again of one of the fabulous costumes worn by one of the ladies and just a nice costume for one of the guys as well again behind them fabulous paintings there and if we just look at one more a couple of image sets here and just um, again replicating great colourful design great choreography and great costumes great characterizations and again similar here great textures great colour and just replicating a great performance so that's about it for this review, so check out Moscow City Ballet's 25th Silver Anniversary Tour if you can, going across the UK, it's a great experience to be had and you'll have a great time. A couple of Google searches to mention now, if you Google Bradford Theatres you can find out information on many of the great shows and events at the theatres that are run by Bradford Theatres and this includes the Alhambra Theatre, St George's Concert Hall and King's Hall in Ilkley. If you Google Moscow City Ballet, you can find out information about the Moscow City Ballet Company. And if you Google PMB Presentations, you can find out information about the production company that are putting on these tours of Moscow City Ballet and also other fabulous ballet companies throughout the country and abroad. And if you Google Don Quixote, you can find out a bit more information about this fabulous story and this fabulous tale and just get a bit more insight into the story that might inspire you to see the stage production. Now, it's necessary to mention here that theatre is something that everybody can enjoy. You can go on your own, you can take your girlfriend, take your boyfriend, take your husband or take your wife, or you can go as a group with the many groups, trips that gets arranged for schools and also companies that arrange group theatre trips. Theatre is something that's affordable, it's accessible and it's enjoyable. So more people should find and seek out this experience because you'll have a great time. So remember to check out what's happening at your local theatres and amateur dramatic societies. Get involved, go and see a show and tell somebody about it to help spread word of mouth about the beauty and magic that can be found within live theatre. It's about time to sign out now, so enjoy the show and see you next time.